Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another Grand Theft Auto 5 Firefighter mod video. Today we'll be playing as Firefighters with DFDNY. We are currently running Rescue 1 and we are here with the Liberty City mod guys. We got Liberty City in GTA 5. It is so cool and it really gives off a New York City feel and I figured that would be perfect since we are using the FDNY and all of the NYPD mods lately. So yeah guys, I really do hope you guys enjoy this one. As always, thank you guys for checking out this video if you are interested in downloading any of these mods or want to learn how to install them check out the link down below in the video description all right guys let's go ahead and get this video started All right, guys, we're getting our first call, a report of a multiple vehicle collision with people trapped inside. All right, we are heading uptown. Let's go. All right, this feels so cool to be driving through the streets of New York. Brings back so many memories of GTA 4. I used to love that game. Oh, I only see a uh, single car. Alright, we're gonna be on scene requesting NYPD for traffic control. And it looks like the person's gonna be stuck in their vehicle. Alright, we're gonna have to try to extricate them. Let's get the generator out. And we'll set this up right there. Let's grab the spreaders. Get that connected, turned on. <laughs> yeah, look how NYPD just showed up with the AR-15. <laughs> That's crazy. All right, here we go. Let's get this opened up. And let's get this in. And right, we're gonna try to cut off this front door. Looks like the patient is unconscious. So we're gonna see if we can revive them and then get them transported with EMS. Alright, we can put that down. Let's grab the medic bag. I'm gonna put this down right there. And let's get him out of the vehicle. <laughs> NYPD parked on the sidewalk. Alright, we got him. Alright, let's do a quick injury assessment on him. Let's see what his injuries are, and then we're going to start treating him. We're still waiting for EMS to arrive on scene for the transport. Uh, he has, oh my god, broken ribs and severe pains. Alright, so we're going to need to give him painkillers and just transport him as soon as possible. Okay, let me try to actually get him up. So, we are going to tend to him. And then we'll get him the painkillers. Alright, hopefully he's gonna be okay. Alright, perfect. He's up. Alright, dispatch. We are still waiting on that ambulance. Uh, sounds like they are getting close. So let's give him the painkillers now. And let's see if we can get him stabilized. We're gonna check his vitals, airways good, breathing is shallow, so we're gonna give him some oxygen. Pulse is weak now, so we are going to add an IV pack to him. And I bet you he's gonna say now his air no his airway's good. Breathing is still shallow, so let's try oxygen again. Just trying to get him stabilized. I 
All right, he is stable. Sounds like EMS is pulling up just in time. All right, got the FDNY ambulance. Hey guys. Damn. All right, so they're gonna transport him. And he should be okay. All right, good job everyone. So that was our first call with the fire department here on the Liberty City maps. Very, very cool. They're gonna get them loaded up. And uh, we're gonna get back in service. I guess we'll call a tow truck. Uh, technically the police will do that, but since they're not gonna do anything but follow us, we can call a tow truck. Uh, let's see, NYPD tow truck or ace towing? Let's get an ace towing tow truck out here. And let's put all of our gear back. And yes, for those of you who don't know, Ace Towing is now operating in Liberty City, guys. It's going to be crazy. So basically what I'm doing is we're going to have like everything that we do in like regular GTA 5, we're going to do in this mod series too. So we're going to do fire, we're going to do EMS. It's, it's going to be so much fun. I'm so excited. All right, let's put this away. Wait, what where did it tell? Oh my god, what is Ace Towing doing over there? Oh my goodness, what in the world? And then they dropped the car. Oh man, they may not be as good as they are in San Andreas. I don't know about these guys. Alright, uh, we go ahead and release the uh, officer dispatch. You can show Rescue 1 back in service. Let's go guys. Now let's head back to the firehouse. Let's take a little drive through Times Square. I always love driving through that area. Gotta love this city. Whoa, that car is going fast. We need some NYPD out here to pull some of these people over. He's driving crazy. Alright, so a little sneak peek of uh, the Times Square area. We're going to be heading back to our firehouse. Uh, we're gonna report of another accident. Looks like multiple vehicles are involved. They said that last time. Let's see what happens this time. I gotta get around this giant construction site. Looks like we're only getting one vehicle. I don't believe 
Alright, looks like we have one person inside the vehicle that is trapped. Let's see if we can get him out. Okay, same thing. We're going to see if we can cut him out of here. I love how it like deforms the car. That is my favorite part about fire callouts. So cool. Alright, let's get this thing cut off. Come on. There we go. Alright, somebody moved the door out the way. I'm going to grab the medic bag. Backup is just like getting in the way. Alright. Let's do injury assessment on him. Broken arm with an open fracture. We're going to have to splint bandage with painkillers. Alright. So we're going to try to do that. Before I do that though, let's just try to get him up. Okay, he's up. Okay, let's take care of his injuries now. So we're going to splint. Bandage, painkillers, I'm gonna have to check his vitals as well. Alright, it says he's stable already, so we are gonna request an ambulance to come pick him up. I wonder how he crashed. It's interesting, we're only getting one accident at a time. Normally with this call, we get two to three, but... Oh wait, oh, there's another one over there, guys. Oh my goodness. You know, I wonder on the other call if we missed somebody. Maybe there was somebody nearby that we missed. Oh no, there's another person over here. I talked too soon, guys. I am talked too soon. All right, let me move all of the gear. You know what, EMS is probably gonna take the other guy. Hopefully I could cut him out before they get here. All right, we're gonna have to do this fast. Come on, come on. Oh, oh my goodness. I just took out a whole pole. All right, let's try to cut this guy up. I cannot believe I missed this. That is terrible. Okay, this one, I'm not able to cut it, so I'm just going to pop the door open and take him out. Alright, EMS is transporting the first person. They're probably going to take this guy, too. I still cannot believe I did not notice that car. Like, did you guys see it before I before I saw it? Let me know in the comments section. We screwed that up a little bit, but at least he's okay. So let's check his vitals. Actually, that makes me do the injury assessment first, so we'll do that. Uh, broken arm. They're gonna take him. Wait, I gotta split and bandage him up. Wait, he's not ready yet. He's not ready. Alright, they can do the rest. Alright, let's get out of here. I didn't mean to pick everything up at once, but I guess I'm a strong fireman. We can do it all by ourselves, because my other firemen, they just got chasers. Oh, whoa, we got another accident on the highway back there. Traffic is out of control. What is going on? 
All right, I gotta try to put all this stuff away. All right, let's see if we can get a tow truck out here. This time we'll call a NYPD as well as a ace towing. And I'm gonna have to try to clear traffic because I'm sure it's gonna get crazy. All right, dispatch, you can show rescue back in service. All right, Ace Towing did a much better job this time. They got that car, and I don't even know where the NYPD tow truck is, but they took the other one, so let's clear the traffic control. There is so many cars here. This, this is not going to end well. We got a standoff. Okay, looks like... Oh, there goes the NYPD tow truck. Nice. Alright, so since nobody knows what to do, I'm going to just try to get out of here myself. Excuse me. Thank you. <laughs> Alright, we're going to head back up town to our firehouse. One ways of New York City can get annoying sometimes because I'm going further away now. like we're just going back and forth and back and forth. Alright guys, so that is going to do it for today's episode. Thank you so much for watching this video. I really do hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, make sure you go ahead and smash that like button. Leave some comments down below. Subscribe if you are new. Also hit that notification bell so you can be notified whenever we post a new video. And if you guys would like to download these mods for yourself, check out my website, acepilot2k7.com. I have all the mods I use there linked on my website, as well as tutorials showing you how to install these mods. If you like to set up the Liberty City, I'm going to have an advanced tutorial for that as well. And if you'd like to become an Acecriber on my website, that gives you access to exclusive videos such as behind the scenes videos, advanced tutorials, uh, videos that are only uploaded on my website. So you get to watch some exclusives and you get to watch some of my videos before they are posted to YouTube. So if you'd like to become an Acecriber, definitely check that out on my website, acepilot2k7.com. But again, Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.